Hello and welcome back to Gnome Regards Journey. We're here in EverQuest and we, uh, so I figured out where she was. She's the Druid Guildmaster. Uh, I should have thought, remember that because we, we, we did get the, uh, this was from last episode. We got, uh, the Moorwalker's quest complete. So we need to, uh, turn this into her, the Return of the Warmark, or, uh, more walkers uh so yeah we got that done last last episode i couldn't remember where she's i couldn't i didn't know where she was so we get a belt from her uh looks like uh i don't think that's an upgrade at this point no but uh we get a belt from her so that's pretty cool and another quest done <laughs> so that was uh it took me a little while i had to actually google that one uh but so we need to get to level 40 to do the rest of the dark tower quests uh and the best way to do that is to go kill uh these bixies for a little bit so that's what we're gonna go do so i'm gonna go ahead and run over to the the forward scout camp with the cook and stuff uh and make sure i got all the quests from there i think i had a cool, full quest log last time i was there but I'm going to do that, and then uh, I'll be back. Oh, that's great. Uh, so we just got the uh, the chest uh, template for uh, doing that quest. So I've been trying to get that for a while. Uh, but yeah, we're almost to uh, to the destination. I've been, I mean, every time I run through here, the uh, named rat and the named snake are like always up. So I always try to kill them, and I finally got it. So we can complete another quest and back in the uh, town. So let's go. I'm, I'm almost there. <laughs> I usually just run through here and this rabbit is just like so fast that uh, it saves so much time. So this is the first camp. Uh, I should have probably sold, but we'll see if that uh, is going to affect us. I need to get some bigger bags. Uh, my... Uh, I've been making money, so I'm hoping to be able to get some. Uh, I, how much do I have on me? 130,000 from just selling uh, rebreathers and defiant stuff that drops. So I think we have enough money to get some uh, better bags, I think, at this point. Or at least look into it and see. I don't know what I can get. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's double check we have all these quests. Because they there's a lot of overlap, and I hope uh, yeah we already got that one. I know this guy has like quests that overlap, and hopefully no, he's not giving it up. Gosh, there we go. We got one here. What is this one? What did we get? Sticky situation. Oh yeah, that's a quest in Stone Hive. That is the next uh, series in the quest line. We got them all though. Oh, jokes on you! <laughs> that's another Stone Hive one. And Buzz the Bixies. Yeah, that's another Stone Hive one. Guess we'll have those for later when we do that. All right, we already have that one and that one. I think we already have all hers, which is just go kill Bixies. Yeah, I think we have all these. Oh, uh, if not, we'll figure it out soon enough. All right, so we're gonna head up in here. So we need to get to level forty. That's our goal. Uh. There we go, we go ahead and kill these. They're already, they're already light blue. So, this is gonna be a, uh, probably a fairly quick, quick time. Uh, let's see here, what buffs are we missing? Call of the, uh, Call of Dead. Uh, do, do, do. Where is that? Conversions? Call Bones. All right, Honey Covered Journal. 
a quest item. Is it a container? Yeah, it is a container. So we need to... Which one is that? Set that out. There we go. That gives us the quest. Uh, what is that? The Bixie Evolution. This one right here. And we just have to locate books. I mean pages. And I think they all can spawn out here. From what I read. But some people said they only spawn in stone hives. So we will find out, won't we? And I don't know if this is an open or a... Uh... Oh, we can't open while mounted. I'm just going to kill them with a, a dot. That way we can... Uh... I think there's little tiny ones that spawn in here. I'm not sure. They do have some hit points, though. There we go. Little wit, <laughs> little ones. So we'll kill these. Giant wasp legs. Don't think that's on the agenda. We'll go ahead and loot that. No, those aren't. Get those dead. Let's go ahead and kill this one. There we go. So we have six wasp. We're gonna knock these. We're gonna knock these out pretty quick. These are uh, almost no challenge at all at this point. I don't think much is as strong as a necromancer in this game. Solo, maybe a mage. And even at that, I'm not uh, I'm not too sure a mage is stronger than a, a necromancer. Their pet might be a little bit stronger sometimes, but I don't think anything can really <laughs> go against a necromancer. Though I've seen some Beast Lord uh, videos, I have never played one, so I'm I'm very interested in uh, actually playing a Beast Lord. That might be uh, something I do. Oh, we lost our temperance finally. Oh, I meant to click that. I guess we should go ahead and actually shield ourselves. We're at 1800 hit points, unbuffed. And conversions, call bones. Oh, there's some more over there. There. We're gonna attack him. And we need a little nine of those, yeah. There, you kill that. I'm gonna dot this thing. So these are just dropping uh nothing we really need. I don't think she is gonna attack it, is she? That'd make it too easy, wouldn't it? But she should assist them, me, when they attack me. I think we're going to need one more of those. Alright, got those. Go ahead and kill this one. And we're going to fall back, let her grab that one. And that one. Fall back a little bit more so we can get Vampiric Curse on it, so we can get a little free healing. Uh, since we don't have the uh, Temperance anymore. We are uh, kind of fragile. I say fragile in the sense that uh, we may die if we don't pay attention. Alright, where's this scout at? What is that? Fine chain bracer. 
All right, we need wasp herders next after this. Go get that on there. Where is a, what is, I don't, oh, we need to kill that guy, that giant bumblebee too. All right, let's get in melee range so we get attacked so we can get these last two. And we'll go kill him too. Just knock all these quests out as fast as we can. This is getting our defense up, which is uh, good. I was afraid of not being able to get that up at all. All right, he's blue still, so that's good. And he did resist our spell, so. And I still didn't cast Call of Bones on me. There we go. And our, our bunny got a little bigger. All right, what are these ones? These are laborers, gardener. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have a quest for them, them yet. So we'll wait on those. We need to find the herders. Right, I'm gonna turn off the relics one for now since I'm not doing that this episode. I don't know where the scout is though. He might be inside Stonehive. Let's see. Oh, he might be dead. Uh I don't really want to waste mana on him. Oh a life tap him. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? We got a mandible, and we can leave the other ones. Got that quest done. All right, we got laborers, slavers, warrior. Do we just kill these to get the gem gem? All right, let's just try that and see if we get anything killing them. They're fairly weak, so. All right, what do we get here? We got a Bixie Stinger. Okay, we needed the raw honey, so that's part of the one of the quests. Meat, I believe. And uh, maybe the stingers. I think we need like everything. Yeah, and then there's a venomous stinger. We need those for. One of these quests. So we can let's turn off this one, this one, and that one, because those are all stone hive. And let's let's just look around, see if we can find the scout. Wait, what's in here? There's a thrall. There's a warrior. Let's kill him. Let's see if we can free the thrall thrall maybe. Maybe he's the scout. Ah, uh, we had a note they gave us, right? It's the leg pattern. Note to Neza. Hmm. All right, we need that, that, and that. All right, let's keep looking around. Warriors. Drone. Hive laborer. Slaver. 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 Jeez, where are the uh, herders? Slaver. Warrior. Warrior. Okay. Wasp egg tender. Oh, there's one. Oh, jeez. She gonna fight all those? I 
I can kite forever if uh, if they're gonna fight. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're fighting them all. Oh, and she. Wow, she's she. I I had a enchanter I ran through here, and the second I got more than four, the stupid mercenary would just run away. This one, he she is like super gnome here, <laughs> like just killing everything. That is hilarious. And my pet died like instantly, I guess. All right, let's kind of try to help her out here and just dot him down. <laughs> Sees all our mana dotting them up. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Alright, two of them are down. This dot alone, like, just murders them. Uh, let's get this guy. Oh, we don't have the mana for him. We do have the mana for a curse, though. Alright, so we have, uh, Call of Bones up. We need to get our pet back out. He is, uh... Yeah, 39 we get a new pet, so... That'll be uh, something we'll need to go do. Let's go ahead and loot that. Our bags are dreadfully full. I'm going to have to sort all that next, between this episode and next. And let's see. Scott Varen. Scout Varen. I don't know where you're at, dude. Red Flower. Jum Jum Farm. But she is like making us, uh, like, giving us tons of experience. I think this is another herder over here. Let's go ahead and auto loot those. Yeah, herder. Let's grab that one. Let her kill that while we get pet mana. And then we'll, uh,. Maybe down, we'll check this building, maybe. That seems like a good spot for that. So, do we have the four stingers? No, we have three. Oh, now we have the four. Okay, can we get our pet out? No. All right, let's run over here. We get, we med full, I guess, while we're running. But we have this uh, combat buff, so we need to wait for that to expire. See if he's like around here out back. No, I don't see him. Can I get a pet? There we go. Let's check the other map just in case it labels where he's at. <laughs> he's right over there. So let's just skip this building that we don't need to do. And get up this way. Yeah, this pet's light blue. So he is somewhere in there. Jeez. Air, though. It says he's right here. Oh, there he is. Oh. Save me. Oh, see if we can hail him, I guess. Oh, he's playing dead. Okay. Uh, 
Let's kill these and I guess tell them it's clear. Oh, we got two gardeners. Where's the other one? Oh, yeah. This is joyful. Oh, man. Here, let's get out of this situation. Oh, we got stunned. I want my mercenary to attack this one. Here, let's just run. Because that is way too many mobs. But she's still fighting. She is a true... A true mercenary. I guess because they're light blue. She knows she can, like, kill them all. I think that's literally the only reason she's not uh, running. Here, let's just need all of these. Are our pets back? Yeah, she's just up here just face tanking all of these. Right, let's heal off that guy. <laughs> yeah, this is just hilarious. So one of these things is healing. I don't know which ones are the healers though, so. She might actually die. She is like... She's taking damage, and I, I don't you don't see that very often. Uh, maybe uh, a gardener is the healer. <laughs> There's multiple gardeners, so let's just dot them all up. We don't have enough mana for this. Yeah, we don't have enough mana for them to even get low enough to do anything. Yeah, they're just chain healing. Can I just tell him clear? Oh, stop, stop. Clear. Oh, you're gonna be like that, aren't you? Not gonna actually... Oh, she killed something. Ah, uh, they're still healing. Maybe she'll go into like berserker mode or something. Like uh, when the warriors get low on life. That'd be kind of funny. There, one's down. Oh, and, oh, I thought she finally ran. Here, let's get this top gardener. Seems pretty low. Yeah, they're not they're not healing as much and we leveled up yeah we don't have the mana oh the merc the mercenary got full life from the leveling up or she did some kind of battle heal or something that's hilarious I just, I haven't seen her run yet from anything. It's just hilarious. All right, we almost have all the pages, so that's definitely worth the effort then. Oh God, more of them. How are we supposed to even clear all these out? <laughs> right, we'll get that laborer. Gardener. <laughs> you go kill that thing. I can leave that. Oh, that's dead. Yeah, 
Okay, now they're starting to get a little mana to heal. Oh, we got another one. Almost have one more page to go and we'll have them all. Uh, let's see if we can get the... No. Not enough mana. Wow, she is just destroying these things. Alright, let's dot this one up. That'll help her kill it. Get the pet up next after this kill. Blob of raw honey. There's a quest. I have a quest for that one. I don't know which one it was though. Oh, we're really, like desperately out of space. A uh, sticky situation. Oh, that's stone hive. Yeah, we got a lot of them to go turn in after uh, after these finally die. What is this? This is a snake skin. We can destroy that. Free up some space. Same with these rat pelts. There we go. <laughs> I can't believe she killed them all. Oh, they respawn. I don't know. How am I supposed to get this guy up? I don't understand. There, go run off, dude. If something attacks you, I'll, I'll protect you. Alright, we got a drone. That'll die. Alright, what do we get? He has killed like so many. How much? We got like a, a bubble, a bubble or two of uh, experience just from this. And there's page five, which we're gonna have to uh, get all that assembled. All right, I'm gonna make the pet instead. God, I didn't want to fight another one. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go back to the camp. Hopefully, uh, I don't even know where he went. There he is. I think you're supposed to escort. Him. But uh, let's go here. All right, speak to Scout Ethereal. There we go, we got that done. 17 Platinum. Uh, Scout Bowen. Got that, and he just wants to us attack, and he's given us two more quests, so I'll take those. So I'll take that one. And... Okay, I guess he's only gonna give us one in, one at a time, which is the exact same one we just did. Uh, okay, <laughs> make sure we don't do hatchery next time. Actually, can I just abandon that? And then jump, jump fields. Yeah, there we go. That's literally what we just killed, but. We need to get the quest done for the uh, achievement. 
All right, and we need to go to the fetcher. I don't think he's here, is he? No, let's go to the fetcher real quick. He's over on the other side of the town. And then uh, I'll have to go through all these quests and see what uh, is something we can actually do. Oh, this is the one we can turn in to uh, the lady over here. She wants six honey. So we have more than six. That is the honey, right? So we'll give her six raw honey. And she's going to give us a box of honeycomb biscuits and a rough scryer's wand. Oh, that's uh, completing all her quests. Okay. That is a... That's an upgrade. Range slot. And... The Fletcher, Fletcher, he's right over here. He only wants four of these. And that gives us... <laughs> like nothing we can use, actually. Uh, yeah. No, we can't use any of these. Alright, let's just select one. We'll have to destroy it. Alright, we completed that quest so we can destroy these. These. Uh, what else did he want? He wanted the mandible. So here it is, a mandible. Got that. And we get a, a 15 stat aug. Go ahead and take that. And there we go. Uh, we gotta, <laughs> I gotta sort my inventory and do that stuff. But uh, yeah, <laughs> we killed quite a few of those uh, those Bixies, and uh, probably one or two more episodes, and we're done with the zone. Uh, we do need to hit forty to uh, go finish up this part. So that's probably gonna be the last episode, finishing up that and doing the boss of the tower. Uh, but we're going to probably have to go here one more time uh, once I figure out what quests we have to g left to go. And then uh, a lot of these quests that I do have right now are stone hive. So yeah, there's four stone hive and then these daily quests. So yeah, that's that. We're going to call it there. So uh, <laughs> he looks cool as a, on, a, on the rabbit with... Uh, skeleton form so thank you very much for watching and have a great day